digital marketing misfits. There's a certain other level, like that's not, re I'll call that retail listening, right? Someone streams a song, the end user is going to be listening to the music, right? There's something called sync licensing, which I had no idea, okay? This guy, XJ Will, we're TikTok mutuals, and I like, his whole shit's fascinating. This guy does like 20 grand a month in sync licensing as a music artist, right? And no one, he's like, no one hears my music ever on Spotify, I'm on anywhere. But what he does is he basically sells his music to like video game placements, TV show placements. Like if you're on the car and someone there's a song playing in the background of a car, like on a random TV show, he'll get paid every time that TV show will air. It's PLR, right? Yeah. And or like a pause. Like think about Basically. if you're the person with the pause music from Goldeneye. If that was your song, you get paid. You get oh, paid. Yeah. Yeah. Paid every <laughs> single time that goes out. <laughs> <clears throat> yep. Like. I was like, I had no idea that, that was even a thing. He's like, yeah, I got, I can make like two grand a month streaming, or I'll make twenty grand a month being sync license, sync license, which is, and it's even could be like loading music on a software. Yeah, it's just yes. stuff that you're just gonna hear, and it's all independent artists creating that content and getting paid forever. It's all going away with AI. You think? Hell yes. No, okay. Now I would say this though, right? AI is good creatively. Okay. Anybody can say, like you said before, chat GPT, make me a soothing piano song, but it's going to take a musician's ear to know if that was good or not. No. I think. Okay. A <laughs> lot of the, yes, I'm not talking like for commercial, like radio play, but a lot of the instances you just talked about, if bit, if people are lit, looking for filler music, filler content, it doesn't need to be good. It just it needs to be background noise. AI it needs to be chat GBT. Make me something that sounds like this right. relative to this commercial. Yeah. Thanks. Can you do that? <laughs> I mean, yeah, there, there's not going to be any reason to not just pay that and not have to worry about the royalty rights, all the schematics. So you're going to have a, you know, an API, a plugin. I mean, you're going to, you're going to pay royalties. That's how chat GPT is going to make money. That's how when all of us are out of work, we're going to get uh, you know a stipend from, the robots but yeah <coughs> i love it's, your dystopian view of the future it, yeah it's definitely gonna happen i mean <laughs> really, is there any doubt oh come on <laughs> skynet will be active we'll get our monthly Bra allowance from the government <laughs> Bra brando it's what plants want it's it's sooner than we think <laughs> it's got electrolytes you know <laughs> yeah yeah oh, there's, there's really not i mean you see it on tiktok and we're in our bubble there's people literally going, okay, what can I, what can I do to make money? The people in the adult industry, the people in, in every industry, people are saying, how can I shorten the runway, make more money because there's no human interaction or anything? Good. Yeah. Well, it's funny. That was, that was something uh, I heard Jason Fladlin say, who's a really, really good marketer. If you ever read his book, he's really good at webinars. But it's like the easiest way to make money is figure out something that people are already selling a lot of, figure yeah. out how to do it twice as fast. Uh -huh. And then you could charge more money and then <laughs> just, like I said, write a song, figure out how to do it twice as fast and you'll be able to sell yeah. it. Yep. And, you, and you're always going to, you're going to have the, oh, that's not Beethoven. That's not real music. And you're like, yeah, that's Never like 10% of the population who gives a shit. The other people, they just want, rah, 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 you know, you got to, you got to Cheeto fingers. Cheeto yeah, fingers. fingers all day long. That needs to be a shirt. You need to have like an <laughs> orange handprint on a shirt that just says Cheeto fingers. <laughs> <laughs> definitely that needs to be a t-shirt and that reddit guy that reddit guy that is on tiktok dom he needs to have oh yeah out. oh yes slappable jerk shout out to the slappable jerk he's got really good characters one of which we enjoy is his average redditor yes because it's so spot on it is <laughs> it's spot on. i know it. I, do you think do you think redditors know that the rest of the world like kind of beats up on them that makes fun but of they're him. They don't care because they are like him. You know what I mean? True. They're so pretentious in their basement. It's uh, he, that's why he's so spot on. That's they come insult. out of their basement. They go to Starbucks. Oh, that's not really a vente or however he talks to the captain. <laughs> you know, nobody cares. Go back home. <laughs> yeah, I'm on a rant. Uh, um, Reddit. Reddit. Yeah, I see no. I have a love hate relationship it. with Reddit. It's like they're grumpy as hell, but like if yeah, you yeah. can cut through the pretentiousness, there is some gold there. Yeah. You're just going to mine for a while. 
Um, but they really hate course sellers over there. Yeah, they do. <laughs> they do. They're so yeah, grumpy. Like, if you say, like, I sell a course on anything, like, oh, you're a scammer. Yeah. <laughs> Just pay it forward and help everybody out for free. It's either, yeah, either they, all yeah free. they want everything for free. They, they want it's, – it's, the argument is it should be free or it is free. You don't need to buy their course. And then they grumble <laughs> and bicker between themselves and then complain about not being able to make money. So it's a vicious cycle. Sounds like 90% of TikTok. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. all social media, right? Like but the, the problem with Reddit, though, is Reddit's anonymous. Like TikTok, people have to get up and show their face. Right. Not the half the people that comment. Like <laughs> True. Yeah, the commenters. They're don't. the ones that bitch and moan. Yeah, but you can't. What's, what's worse, Reddit or Discord? Because you don't have to show your, you don't. Well, no, because you're invited into the Discord and you can. Yeah, but even then, though, Scotty, we saw, we, we had that experiment with Discord. Half the people were like, I'm not going to show my face. Like, I, I defaulted when we were doing Zoom meetings and Zoom training. Right? I defaulted the camera on, and people yeah. would, answer, would, would like, you just see this when people would come on. It would just be hand over, like, they don't want to see it. I'm like, you want to be content creators and affiliate marketers. You have to, like, do this. Yeah. But, Andrew told, Tate told me I could do it without showing my face. So that's oh, why God. I'm here. <laughs> 